Hey guys, Luke here, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can duplicate apps on your iPhone. Be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and click the bell icon to be notified every time I upload a new video. Now this is a really cool method for if you've maybe got another account or something that you don't want anyone to see. And obviously I know that Facebook and Instagram will give you the options to have another account listed on the same app. But this is for people that maybe want to keep this app in a separate folder away and have them completely separate from each other so that you don't need to switch between accounts. It's rather having two completely separate apps. And it's actually a really simple method to do. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do it. So first of all, you're gonna to wanna to click on the first link in the description, which will bring you to appvalley.vip. And what App Valley is, is it's a tool that allows you to download tweaked applications. It shouldn't take too long to download onto your device. If you get an untrusted developer notification, then all you need to do is go into settings, profiles and device management, and then you wanna accept the appropriate profile that links to App Valley. So this trick is actually really simple. All you wanna do is go into App Valley and download the duplicate versions of the tweaked apps that you want to actually have a secondary icon for. So for instance, if you want to have another Facebook app, all you need to do is go to App Valley and then look for the Facebook plus plus version or the tweaked version of Facebook. And you wanna download it as a duplicate version. Same goes for Instagram. If you want the Instagram version, you just need to download Instagram plus plus or the tweaked version of Instagram. And obviously same goes for YouTube and there's quite a lot of other apps as well that you can also download a duplicate version of. So when you go into App Valley looking for the app that you want to have a duplicate version of, it will give you two options for most of the applications where it will say, do you want to overwrite the original application that you've got, which is not what you want obviously for duplicating an icon, or you can click on install as a duplicate. So it's actually a really simple method, but some of you guys may not have known how to do it. And I just wanted to let you know about this method so that you guys could try it out for yourselves. If you do, then please be sure to uh, hit the like button down below and obviously let me know how you get on by leaving a comment down in the comment section down below. And of course, I'll see you all in the next video.